Well, hello everybody, Queen Bee here. Welcome, welcome, welcome to episode two of Northern Lights. Um, I'm having such a good time playing this game, guys. Um, I just cut down a tree and my light went out, my fire went out, but that's fine. Uh, if you want to have a look here, I've crafted up a bow. I'm just going to craft up a few arrows um, here. What am I missing? What am I missing? I'm not sure. But um, let's have a look. We've got plenty of sticks. I'm not quite sure what we're missing. Oh, feathers. That's all right, though. Because what I'm going to try and do... Check out the bow. Shit. Oh. Ah, he's gone. He's gone. Okay, so the animals need a little bit of work. Um, but that's fine. That's fine. Let's grab ourselves a hatchet. Or oh, actually, we've got a knife now, haven't we? This will Let's keep me fed for a while. Butcher this bad boy. Ah. It's the middle of the night. It's all going well. We can. It's it's very nice that uh, arrows are you know retrievable. But yeah, our fire went out, so I kind of feel like we we just come back over here. We do have a little bit of a fever. I had a little bit of a look, and it said that fevers will heal over time. They heal quicker if you are, uh, let's say, sleeping proper sleeping, which is great course so what i think we're going to do is we're going to pop down this and then we're going to put our fire right next to it um let me can we harvest that firewood nice can we then harvest the firewood is it like how how intuitive is this game oh yeah sticks sticks oh yes cool so we're going to pop our sticks in here, like so. Marvellous. Sleeping is the best way to restore your energy. And the only way to save the game. Oh, wow. Um, while sleeping, the rest of your sets will decrease over time. Pay attention to how much you sleep. Make sure you have the necessary resources to do so. Press space to continue. Oh. This game is running sweet. It's like at 90 odd FPS. Which is great. So let me uh, pop that down. Next, I want to pop myself a fire, like, right next to me. So let's come here. We'll pop a fire, craft a fire, put that there so we stay nice and warm. There we go. E to build. I need some more sticks. Harvest that. Turn you into sticks. You into sticks. You into sticks. Okay. And then we're going to put Tinder in there. This game is good, guys. Put the starter in there. Bob's your uncle, aren't you, Fanny? Oh, yes, yes. Uh, let's press E to use. We're going to pop that there. And we're going to space to melt snow. Marvellous. Pop our venison in here. Oh, we made venison. It's so good. There we go. And I think, like, we're just going to sleep a little bit. Get fully rested. Your survival in Arctic Tundra can only be achieved if you pay attention to your stats. Um, they can be trapped by pressing T, interacting with your watch. This is great, guys. I'm loving it. It's very informative. Um, so I didn't mean to wake up, but, you know, fuck it. Oh, burned. Ah, oh, shit, we burned our venison. Let's delete it. It's charcoal's good for you. It's really good for you. Let's uh, consume that. We can't, like, just put a water canister into our inventory, which is a bit shit, but, like, that's all right. What's, what's this saying? Three, three sticks, fine. 
health issues. Okay, what was it? T? Time. Food, drink. Right, we're going to need more drink. Temperature, daylight, wind, time. Yeah. Right, we need more. We need more water. Melt the snow. This feels like green hell all over again. I'm really not comfortable with eating shit from this cave. Let's melt some more snow. This is long dark. Melt the snow, drink the snow. We'll probably go up to the mysterious woods today. I think that's what we do. So, what's it? See the compass. We need to go north, really, from here. Don't we? Kind of northwest a bit. Northeast, sorry. And all in all, guys, I'm loving this game. It's plain smooth, it's it's fun, there's a lot to do, it's a bit of a challenge. I, I normally am like kind of tundra and tropical, kind of like normally a, a kind of more tropical, um, foresty kind of, you know, jungle survival type person. Never normally play the Arctic. Oh, but don't get me wrong, I do play the Long Dark. I have played that and I play it privately. It's not really a cold person. <laughs> well, I mean, I am cold. Very cold. I could kill that deer. I'm that cold. Ooh, we've got mushrooms. Stores. But I'm liking this. Um, and once again, I have to say a huge shout out to the devs who have not only created this game, which is very nicely uh, seems to have a lot going for it a lot going for it um, but also for reaching out to me and offering me a key so that I could play this and I kid you not guys if I didn't like this game freaky or not I would say but yeah I'm quite I'm quite captivated by it I do understand it's had quite an overhaul um, they very much listened to the community and, um, and, and changed a few things you know, in the light of feedback. Um, and this is this is the story mode we're playing. That the story mode is, is just literally dropped on the. I think I read the twenty fifth of June. So like, really, like, very recently. But yeah, it's it's a nice game. It's uh, keeping me entertained. Certainly, I hope it's keeping you entertained. Thank you for your eggs is. How do we cook eggs is a question that I want to know the answer to. Fucking speedy bunny over there. It's fucking Usain Bolt bunny. Look at it. It's easier to catch a deer than that thing. I don't know why I'm getting these because I'm too frightened to fucking use them. It's a fox over there. I'm really not sure. How friendly foxes are in this game. Should we test it out? Should we for science it, guys? Here, fox. Oh, no, he's a runner. Bastard. Let's keep looking out. Oh, it's freezing cold. It's fine. What are you talking about? You're orange. Oh, body temperature. After wandering through the cold of Siberia, your body temperature dropped drastically. Stand next to a heat source. Fuck off. We're fine. I should get a fire going, but how will I get some wood? Honestly, stop being such a pussy. Right, map. I was slowly getting there. Like, quickly enough. Though. Time to chop some trees. We've chopped some motherfucking trees, guys. We've already chopped trees. But apparently the tutorial clearly wants us to chop more. Alright, so so let's let's go with the tutorial. 
There we are. Place a fire blueprint. Okay, so we've already done that twice, but we'll do it again. Uh, we're kind of overburdened as well, so we could get rid of some of these sticks. So, let's place a fire. Ba -bum. This should do. Now, to get it burning. Okay. Pop a nest in there. Pop our Come on. fire starter. Come on! Oh my god, that is so green hell. Come on! Come on! That's exactly what it says. There we go. Warm up at the fire. We're, we're completely roasty toasty, but let's warm up at the fire. Gosh, let's... Hey, what's our weight looking like? 32 at uh, 35. Let's not harvest this. We're warming up at the fire. Guys, I'm just going to stand here warming up at the fire. We've still got a fever. Well, okay. Food poisoning. How have we got food, food poisoning when we have not Again, we, our sanity is going down. I don't know, like, how can we... How can we check that? Fever. Increases dehydration. Temporarily reduces sanity. Naturally it's thought too late of... to travel now. I should craft myself a bed. Naturally fought off by sleeping. Oh, gradually lose energy. So these are all the tutorial things. Consume a herb with antipyretic. I mean, should, should we just give give something a go, shall we? Maybe. <laughs> Let's persuade it. Um, ten hours. Right, these are like also unknown effects. I don't want to destroy it. Let's continue that. Bad idea. Yeah, not good. Oh no, I'm probably not going to go with that. Let's consume. We can. Oh, we can consume mushrooms. Nice. We'll do that. Right, we are nice and warm now. Now, that does fuck with your whole hydration, so let's melt some snow quickly. Let's press T. We can't press T. Oh, well, my hydration isn't that mm, bad. Smells good. It does. Water smells so good. There we go. That'll do. Right, we're going. Keep going. Keep on running. Do you know what? Fuck it up. Let's come back over here, craft a sick bed, rest up, and then we'll move on. So, let's come into... Where are we? Bed. So we already did this, but we're going to do it again. Good enough for a quick nap. Time for some rest. And it should really get going now. Fucking how's the, how's the fuel going? Harvest. Okay, I should. Can I just like put? Yes. Okay. Let's take a little bit longer. That'll do. That'll do, Pig. That'll do. Let's go. The game has been saved. Let's go to the mysterious woods. Could really do with finding some more uh, mushrooms or. Wait, like, even. How can we fry eggs? Need to find out how to fry eggs. Or make some kind of herbal tea. Or berries. Sweet, we've got some berries. berries. Yeah, we've Let's got berries. Let's hope they aren't poisonous. Let's uh five hydration, eleven hunger. We will consume all the berries. That's good. Save everything else. And we're going in the right direction, I think. Yeah, we're on track. 
find out what happened in the mysterious woods. Okay, guys, so one thing that I've noticed, you know, I was just thinking to myself, I had to pause the game, step away for a second, and I was thinking, the one thing I can't, you can't tell in this game is you get told when you've got an affliction, you don't get told when it's treated by the looks of things or how it's treated. You, you can't, like, see it on your watch. You can see your hunger, your thirst, your tiredness, and all of that. When you pause the game, it says day one, resourceful. That's the level you're playing on. Distance travelled, afflictions treated, too. So I, w I had a fever twice, and it's obviously cleared up. It's been treated, but I don't know when it's cured, what level it is. Um, I can't see that in any stat. There probably is a stat that you can see see but I, I must have missed that animals hunted one items crafted 12 i like this these like basic stats there great but the uh the afflictions i'd really like to be able to to get you know more of an overview of those so let's have a look here yeah we'll go up over this bit of this brow of the hill but all in all this game is sweet and uh, a real nice diversion while I'm uh, convalescing with the uh, with the whole positive test COVID bollocks. Not a fan of being poorly at the best of times. Let's have a look. What's that? What's that? Chaga mushroom. Not sure if that's poisonous or not, but I bet I'll find out soon. And I get desperate enough to eat it. Right. So we're picking up all these eggs. Not actually got much to do with them. Couldn't work out how to cook them. We'll have to have a go at that again. Let's grab those roots. They're good for rope. Could really, really do with some more dead birds knocking around the place so we can get some feathers. Right, what came first? The feather or the bird? Gosh, it's quite a ways. It's a ways away. Temperature's good though. Very happy about the temperature. Very, very white. Like, you could get snow blindness playing this game. But I suppose it's, you know, it's... It's what it's supposed to feel like, isn't it? Up in the Arctic tundra. It would be really nice. I would like to see uh, the occasional feathers gathered from these nests. Crafting helps with sanity. As I said, very don't starve-esque. Oh yeah, we've got two spears now. Okay. I didn't mean to craft two spears. I thought I've crafted a stone knife and one spear. Oh, wow. I'm probably not going to get down there, am I? <clears throat> okay, but let's get our bee goggles out. Okay, let's press M. So... I don't know. Can we go in that way? I think we've probably got to go around. Gosh, that's a long ways to go. I think this is probably going to be the only way down that we can get, though. So I think, yeah, we're going to go this way. Maybe we can get, like, bounce our way down. <laughs> Oh man, I think we can probably get down that bit without having to go all the way around. I might even do a giveaway for this game at some point, guys. I think like there's a lot of people I know in the hive um, that that like these kind of games. It's fun. Fox down there. Did we have, just before we go down there, we've got a couple more arrows left. <coughs> Ow! Fudge. 
careful. Can't take much in the way of fall damage, apparently. Just have to mooch our way down here. Perfect. That's much better. Oh, what's that? Pine sap. Don't mind if we do. What's it? No, 35.4. We've got unknown mushrooms. Be nice to have a eat wall kind of option. 34.6. Oh my god, they weighed a whole kilo. I'm going to leave that park. of eggs so it gives us hunger but sanity is a bitch what's that spoiled chaga mushroom we could get rid of that yeah i'm not i'm not sold on the whole bag graphics it is in in, in early development and my opinion would be develop develop this make it look more in line with the actual game. The game has got beautiful graphics, really nice graphics. Like the trees look like trees and the stones look like stones. This is cartoony. I would would like to see a bit of a change on the old uh, bag front. Oh, what have we got? Red mushrooms, probably dangerous. To be fair, nothing good ever came from eating a red mushroom. Come back! That's my spear, bitch! Thank you. Right, we have a hatchet. Oh! Wow! Yeah, yeah. Okay, what? We need to do a bit of shuffling. Every day I'm shuffling. There we are. Why are we running in the wrong friggin' direction? Right, we're just gonna settle camp here. Warm ourselves up, cook up a bit of food. That should be good. So we come into here, we come into fire, we put this down, craft it up there. Harvest that. Got plenty of tinder. <laughs> tinder I don't I just think of that was dating stuff so there. Not that I've ever used it. Um I promise you I have not, but let's pop my Food container in. Can we cook our eggs in there? No. No. We can only just consume them raw, apparently. Melt some snow. Okay. It's not a problem. That gave me an issue with my sanity earlier, but apparently now it's fine. Not, not that cold now. Not cooked enough. Let me cook up our food, sort our water out, and uh, what's it? Tea for watch. Food's fine. We just need to get warm. Not cooked enough. It's fine. Let's uh, consume our water. As well. Just do another water while our food's cooking up. We're going to throw that out because it's spoiled. Temperature's good. Let's go. No hanging around for the wicked. <laughs> the fuck? Let's get back to our fire. He's a freaking pansy.
sense our temperature's fine. Let me let me see what's the general temperature of the world. Twenty six point four affliction cured hypothermia. Twenty six point four degrees C. That's yeah, that doesn't work because if it was twenty six point four degrees C guys, this bitch here would be sat in the garden with a pina colada and her feet in a, a bucket of ice, I tell you. So I think that the temperature... Oh shit, I'm still open, but... It seems that we're alright. Being overburdened hasn't stopped me from being able to walk around. Um, so, yeah, we're all good. We're all good. I was wondering, can we, like, scale this easily? I'm sure. These rocks look pretty bleak, but I'm going to give it a go. And I kind of feel like, I, I think there must be wolves in this game. I haven't heard any, but... In fact, the wildlife sounds don't seem particularly loud at the moment. Just going to see if we can get up here this way. There we go. Maybe we can get up here. Yes! Get in there. Get in there, guys. She's on a roll. No stopping her now. Don't stop me now. Having such a good time. Ah, they're almost at the top. I have no idea if this is the right direction. I kind of feel it might be. What's this? Is this mineable? Or is it just a weird outcrop? Okay. Still not there. But we are going in the right direction. I feel it in my waters. I feel it in my bones. I've said it before and I'll say it again. It is so very white. I mean, it's what you would expect in the Arctic tundra, but it's very, very white. It's a long, hard trek over here. Let's see what we can see. Not very much. Tell me pickles. It's a little bit... Oh, there's a river over there. I like the binoculars, though. I wonder what the, the game tell you every time there's something in the vicinity. Um, or is it just best that you keep getting your binoculars out? The binocs. What's this? I haven't seen any more of those berries for a while. Oh! Oh! We're right on the edge of it now. Right on the edge of the mysterious woods. Oh, hang on. What did I just press? Food poisoning. See? Look. Press Q. Infection risk. Food poisoning. Oh, okay. It's the green bar and the yellow bar. That's cool. I knew I was missing something. Yeah, that that must be the mysterious woods. <gasps> oh, and look, there's an encampment over there. That's where we need to go. We will go there in episode three. Thank you for joining me for, for episode two. I hope you're enjoying this as much as I'm enjoying exploring this. It's a great game. I'm, I'm really loving it. Again, thank you very much to Magnet Studios for, for the key for contacting me, asking me to play the game. It's great. And uh, I'm thoroughly enjoying it. Um, so, yeah, guys, hope you'll join me for episode three. Hope you've enjoyed episode one and two. And if you have, don't forget, consider liking and subbing to the channel if you haven't done so already. And do comment in the comment section. Let me know what you think of this game. Is it something you've played? Is it something you want to play? But, uh, yeah, for now... This is where we're going to leave it. 
do hope you've enjoyed it. Till next time, guys, stay safe and take care.